Hello everybody, welcome to your Farm Sim 15 uh, mod spotlight. We have a pack, a sort of pack, and a not pack. So let's let's just get into it then. We have in uh, potato harvesters, we have a Grim GT170 bunker. 28,000 to buy, 35 a day to own, 2,500 liter capacity, and a 2 meter working width. Let's buy that really quick. Now, 28,000 to buy this thing, 2 meter working width. The question is, does it have a built-in cutter? If it does have a built-in cutter, let's look at what we have in potato harvesting over here. 127,000 to buy with a 2 meter working width. Now, that has a much larger capacity, but we might be looking at something that's really great. I bet you we're going to have to buy this, though. But we'll, we'll see. We'll see. All right, let's go back over here. And in mowers i have a mower pack we have x marks we have the uh laser z the laser z bigger the walk behind and then over here we have a walker t30i um expensive actually compare that to the new holland uh bush hog but let's uh let's buy these okay so it's fifteen thousand for these two they got a 1.8 meter working width and 35 a day to own yeah all right and then the walk behind is smaller working with, not by a heck of a lot, but a nice big drop in price. Okay, how do you walk behind? That looks like you, oh no, there, there is, okay. And then we have this walker here, which looks like it might be, well, I don't know. We'll buy it. <laughs> and that's not all we've got in trucks. We have a Gaz Saws 35071. 22,000 to buy this thing, 43 day to own. It's 105 horsepower of a Russian, Ukrainian, Eastern European truck. In tippers, we have a whole bunch of tippers for this thing. So the uh, the Saws 83173, it's 12, 1250 to buy, 5,000 liter capacity. Now, if we take the, the Dash M model, we get a 10,000 liters of capacity there. So you got a good, you got to double your capacity. Now notice though, look at all these fruits here. Look at how much it cuts down in terms of fruit. So this is more of a foraging unit. This is truly a transporter. And then the trailers, we have the same thing. So we're gonna we're gonna go with this only because I'm gonna be harvesting potatoes and potatoes is in this list, right? Yeah, right there. Haha. <laughs> Let's get that and that. Cool. Let's check these guys out. Boom. All right. Um, I don't think there's a cutter there, but I could be wrong. That is quite the uh, quite the piece of machinery there. Got nice close wheels. It is clipped in, but hopefully it'll be able. We'll be able to pull it out. I keep getting caught on. Oh, okay. There's actually an invisible thing right there. It's kind of annoying. Is it on the other side? It is on the other side. Okay. All right. Here's our laser mower with the Ultra Cut 72 Series 4. All right. So that's that one. This one has a bagger on it. And this one is the walk behind. And then we have this little walker thing. Cool. And this is our gauze truck. Nice looking gauze truck. We don't fall through it anywhere. And the best part is these... This thing, it spawned in and didn't go flying into space. <laughs> it's an important thing. And there's our trailer. Okay, let's start with the uh, bunker thing. Let's go get our track door. All right. We'll take this guy. We're going to go hook up to this thing. We'll see if the uh, if it has a cutter on it. All right. So we'll pull it out. Oh, I was like, oh my gosh, it, the, the chain linking disappeared for the conveyor. But if you just look in the right way, it comes back. It's an interesting um, thing. All right, let's unfold it. So it goes down there. Is that really it? Pipe out is that. Okay. Hmm. We're gonna have to go and we're gonna have to go uh, 
fold this guy up. We're going to have to actually go test it out in a in one of my fields. I'm going to go ahead and buy in here that topper there just in case we need it so I don't actually have to come all the way back here to get it. What side do I connect to this onto? Like this? Yes. All right, good. All right, just in case we have the topper. So we have that. Ooh, don't hit it. Ooh. All right, so let's park this guy here really quick. Because we'll, be, uh, we'll be taking the gauze up with that. Let's check out our mowers. So this is our mower that doesn't do any bagging. Okay. We are, we are very, very straight up and down in our seat. Sounds like a mower. Okay. That's all on. Oh my goodness. If I, if I turn that off, I've just pressed the gas pedal. I'm holding it down. Nothing. Now if I turn on diff and all-wheel drive, now we can go. Awesome. Okay, this is like a zero turn unit. Oh, these things are dangerous. All right, let's go turn on the mower. And it's truly a mower. Doesn't, doesn't collect anything. Doesn't leave any residue behind. Okay, interesting. I kind of expected it to leave like that. Hmm. All right. What does this one do then? Does this one, does this one collect? This one I bet does, because it says disable grass pickup, so. There we go, so this one picks up, the other one doesn't. The other one like mulches and makes it disappear. What kind of capacity do we have here? All right, so it's just blown through the capacity of the profi hopper, I think, if I remember correctly. Wow, this thing has got quite the capacity on it. Drive around in our little zero turn unit. Ooh, that's not a zero turn. That is, though. And boom, there we go. So 4,500 liters of capacity on this thing. Nice. I can go feed some sheep or something. That would involve me actually having sheep to feed. It would also involve me driving a long ways. All right, so that's that unit. So that one actually does the collection. That's cool. Let's go check out the walk behind. I bet you it won't. How is that a walk behind? It's a ride behind. Maybe I misread it. Probably did. All right. Let's, oh, look, we can actually see our speeds and everything. That's pretty cool. All right. Does this move when I hit turn it on? No, of course not. All right. How are we doing? All right, just like the other one, there is no, there is no discharge on that. Okay, so these two are birds of a feather. Cool. Let's check out this one, which I think is gonna be birds of a feather with the other. Ah, and it runs without needing diff lock on all wheel drive. That's good. Let's turn it on. All right, so now we got another mower that will collect I probably could go look at the capacity, but let's just mow. Mowing is so just zen. Oh, look at that. We have a special camera view. What is that camera view for exactly? And why am I not in the seat? Oh my gosh. Uh. All right. So this thing looks like it's going to be about equal. I think it's going to be 2,400 liters as well. Now the ones that don't collect, I guess you could use them for like cleaning up around your farmhouse or whatever. Because, I mean, let's be honest, sometimes we just got grass in the weirdest places on these maps. So we're going to get to, yeah, it looks like we're going to be at 2,400. Or not 2,400, 4,500, that's the word. Yes, 4,500. So you, this one goes and matches with this easy mark here. So those, those two collect 4,500 liters. Those two over there collect nothing and leave no trail. Hey, truck. Ooh, I like the interior of this truck. I 
I like the sound of this truck too. All right, we got blinkers, good. Six turns on headlights. All right. Good horn, good horn. No all-wheel drive, no diff lock, which I honestly didn't expect. There we go. I like how our head is almost out of the uh, roof there. It's a, it's a very short cab truck. It looks good though. It really does. It really looks really good. The turning radius is very slow, very, very deliberate, which is what I would expect with a truck like this, actually. Okay, N closes the cover. Oh, look at that. So then if I go over here, look at that. We close and open the cover all we want. Sweet. All right, so we got the gauze. We got the, uh, the Grim. Let's go make sure the Grim works and discharges into the gauze truck. We'll be back when we're up at the potato place. Potato field. Field of potatoes. Potato field. All right. So we're back here at the field. Let's go to this guy. Get him all ready to go. Now, I... I, while driving up here, I was looking more and more at this, and I was like, I don't think that it's a topper, but let's find out. <gasps> it is a topper! Oh, that's excellent. So we're going to get full harvest on this one run, so it's 27,000 for this, and it does all the job we need right there. Looks pretty decent going up there, filling up the hopper in the back there. The dirt at the bottom that's getting shaked off, shaked off, shaken off. I don't know words. The rear wheels turn on this thing, so you get a nice tight turning radius. Oh, it just looks wonderful. It looks wonderful. That is actually that is actually really nice. Inexpensive and does the job. And that's what we like. I mean, not all the time, but sometimes. Okay, so it works well for its job. Let's see if we can empty something into this gauze here. I know some of you are like, oh my gosh, you're destroying the field. I know. All right, so pipe is over the trailer. Oh, it's going automatically. There we go. Look at it go, and it's going to fill up our little gauze truck. Actually looks pretty good doing it, too. Yeah. That looks good. Excellent. So we don't even need this thing. Boop. So that thing is even cheaper. Now we've got ourselves some goodies in the gauze. Let's drop that for right now. All right, let's check out how this thing dumps out. So that's really cool that 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 grim unit is a chopper or a topper and a harvester. So that's pretty cool. Let's see, I think it's somewhere in here is my potato. I think. I think. Are you potato? Yes, you are potato. All right. Unload. Potato is not accepted here. Okay, then you must be the potato. I don't know why it's covered like that, but hey, whatever, right? Right. There we go. Oh, look. It, okay. Nice. And then when that closes, then you get the little... Nice. Excellent animation on the dumpy. Very cool. So we got ourselves a nice little gauze truck with a saws trailer and bed. We've got ourselves this um, with a grim thing. I just had a thought. Wait a minute. No, you don't have a PTO. Sh oops. Shouldn't work. Should not work. Let's hope it doesn't. <laughs> 
Uh, it'd be kind of funny if it did, but also not funny at the same time. Good, 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 good. Just making sure. Just making sure. All right, so we have the gas truck. We have the grim uh, potato bunker thing, whatever that is. And then we had the the mowing pack that came with four mowers. Two mowers have capacity of 4,500 liters. Two have no capacity and leave no trail. They do some sort of mulchy, choppy thingy. Uh, but they could still be useful to you if you need mowers. And dear Chappers, this has been your Farming Simulator 15 Mod Spotlight. Until next time, game on and be awesome, everybody.